Good day, folks. If you recall, a few weeks ago, I did a review of the Ulanzi macro lens for the DJI Osmo Pocket. In today's video, we're going to be taking a closer look at a macro lens for the Osmo Action. So let's just jump right in and take a closer look. So Ulanzi has really gotten into a lot of different lenses for a lot of different types of cameras. You can see here they're also offering ND filters. Here's a CPL filter, we got an ND16, ND8, ND64, and here's their ND32. You can see they come in these nice little aluminum boxes. In today's video, we're going to mainly focus on their macro lens for the Osmo Action. When you purchase it, it comes in these little aluminum cases, and that's kind of nice. It does keep it protected when not in use. They also come with a lens cap to keep the lens protected when you have it stored in a camera bag. Installation is really easy. It's just a matter of taking off this stock lens that comes with the Osmo Action, and it just screws on the same way you would put an ND filter on it. This has 15 times magnification to help you get those nice uh, creative close-ups. Now macro photography is definitely not for everybody. It's one of those things either you love it or you just have no interest in it. I don't take a lot of macro photos myself. Uh, my girlfriend does. In fact, uh, she'll be making very good use of that lens once I'm done reviewing it. So if you're not quite familiar what a macro lens does, it basically allows you to get in and take an extreme close-up of something. All cameras have a minimum focus distance, so if you try to get in too close to something to get a close-up, it's going to be blurry. The camera just can't focus on it. Here's an example. If we're trying to get in and take a close-up of this flower here, you can see the camera just cannot get a focus. And that's where a macro lens comes in. Now, if you try to film anything else other than something close up, it's going to be all blurry. So uh, the only thing these are really useful for is getting close ups. They're super simple to use. It's just a matter of powering on your Osmo Action and using it like you normally would. So just to test it out, let's go out in the back garden and see what kind of images we can capture. Now quickly before I go here, I'm going to show you another lens that Ulanzi is selling for the Osmo Action. Now this is a fisheye lens, and as you can see it looks very similar. We'll take off the macro lens and then we will add the fisheye lens. You can see it comes with a cap as well. So basically a fisheye lens allows you to get a little bit more data in your pictures and videos. Uh, they are heavily distorted as you can see here in some of the samples. Personally, I don't know how useful these are to myself. Um, it's not something that I think I would use on an everyday basis. Um, if you're into getting some kind of creative shots for your Instagram, it's one of those things that definitely you wouldn't be using very often, uh, but they do come in handy once in a while. Well, folks, that's basically it for my video. That is the 15 times macro lens for the DJI Osmo Action by Ulanzi. If you're into macro photography, definitely go and check it out. I'll leave the links down below in the description. Thanks a lot for watching this video. Give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you don't miss any of our upcoming videos, and we'll see you in the next one.